Strike Squad, Darren Stoney here. I have a strike combination for you, an MMA inspired kickbox combo. I usually do this one off to the side. Um, you of course could do it to the front, but I find it's easier to do it this way. You simply start with a jab, give them a target, leaning into it, then you can double that jab, bring it back. Then you add in an uppercut. So jab, jab, upper, jab, jab, upper. That fist position changes. Then you add in a shin, right here, getting them to understand the basic movement, creating a line of defense. Then you go basic and power. So basic, power. Then we'll just put the two together, double jab, uppercut, two shin, basic and power. Jab, jab, upper, basic, good. Couple more. One more. Then we'll learn part B. Bring it down and twist. This is defensive. You're gonna keep everything tight up here. The less of you there is to punch, the less of you there is to punch. Redundant but true. Hands are gonna come up, forearms are protective. You are blocking a punch that's coming at you. So twisting, using your butt cheek to help and your core as well. Then you simply add in, it's a twist, elbow. So it looks like this, twist, elbow. That power elbow is hitting them in the temple as they come forward off balance. So twist, elbow. That's just the first part. Second part, hammer fist, set. Hammer. When you go into a hammer, you're using this part of your fist right here. Then you just add a duck. Still using the core and the butt cheek to help drive that hand forward. Keeping the elbow bent. Let's put those four together. Looks like this. Twist, elbow, hammer, duck. Twist, elbow, hammer, duck. Twist, elbow, hammer, and a duck. Then we put the whole thing together. Jab, jab, the cut. Shin, and twist, elbow, hammer. That's all there is to it. And then you can choose whatever transition you like. 